I don't know, guys. It's freaking weird. It's like a cult stuff going on. Like a freaking cult clickbait in this town. You guys, I, um, I was sitting outside, like, reading my Bible, an audio Bible, right? Because I found some scripture on the ground when I was walking. I was reading it, like, interested in reading it. I was sitting on the bench reading it with audio. And then somebody drove past and said the N-word. I'm like, again? Like, what's going on? This is, like, the second time that I'm going through that. And then there's freaking cars following me when I'm outside, like certain freaking cars. I'm like, am I a freaking target or something? Like, this is like, it's like targeting me, certain individuals here in this town. And it's freaking weird because I don't know anybody here. Like, what is this about? Like, I know it's racist, whatever. Like, it's like I'm a freaking enemy or like I did something to, to certain individuals to be going through this stuff. And I didn't. I came here from a different freaking region to come to, like, better myself. And I'm still experiencing this craziness going on here. Craziness. More craziness. <laughs> And the weird part is that they know about my such and such. And only certain people that I told about, which I didn't tell my whole life story around here, the neighbor across the street, um, the one next door, and the one in the black car. That's about it. Nobody else should know anything about my etc. or what I have, you know? Like, oh, and the weird guy I was sleeping at when I was homeless. Um, I don't even remember if I told him that. Um, who else? My aunt. They know that, but it's really nobody's business because I don't post everything on my YouTube channel, my personal life. But it's really, really freaking strange. It could be one of them, like having people follow me, et cetera, doing stuff on my channel. Like you can't freaking trust people. Like you never know like who's doing stuff. And every time I go to Sheep City, they're freaking looking at me wearily. Like staring at me freaking weird. Them young dudes that work in there. Freaking weirdos. When I first came here, there was some stuff going on, some weird stuff. I'm like, 
why are you calling me? Because I already reported everything that my address is stuff and cetera, changing and all that type of stuff. Somebody did some weird stuff and I don't know who it was. Um, they'll do anything to get your freaking address. They'll do anything just to get something information because you know you don't want to talk to them. If you're like by yourself and everything and you're freaking dead. Mind your business, not doing anything. The freaking busybody is in this town. And you love how they consume stuff and you don't know what you're talking about. People don't know how to mind business. They worry about everybody else's affairs and start their own business. Worrying about why not this, why not that. It's none of your freaking business. <laughs> 